Hello everybody, Georgie Burns here. Today I'd like to show you how I made this pretty quick and easy card. To make this card I used the stamp set Butterfly Gala and I used this image, the two butterflies and the Hello Beautiful. I also used both um, antenna stamps which I haven't got out so let's just get them out um, there's the big one stick that on a block and the little one stick that on a block dead tiny stamps And I also use the inside, they say it's your birthday, and that's come from Itty Bitty Birthdays, and I used this image here, they say it's your birthday. So that's the two stamp sets. Um, the card you'll need is one white blank card base at eight and a quarter by five and seven eighths scored up. Four and one eighth and folded in half and burnished. And you also need two pieces of white cardstock at five and five eighths by three and seven eighths. One for the inside and one for the front. We'll keep them out because we're going to stamp on them. This is so quick, this card. I also used um, light lovely lipstick and dark mint macaron for the butterflies colouring them in and I also used a black Versafine Onyx black ink so to get started we're going to put the sentiment first just so I know where to put the butterflies and I want the sentiment down here to the bottom right of the card. Just like that. Ooh, let's get my cleaning cloth out. Which is quite dry. I'm just going to spray it. Also need, and I've got a black mark on there. So I can get that black mark off. Gone. You also need a um, black marker pen. This is to do the little dashes that I did. So, my big butterfly, remember I've cut my butterflies in half, I didn't have them together anymore, and I'm going to put one there, and and keep my paper clean so I'm going to put a bit of scrap paper underneath and I'm going to put one going off there and I'm going to put one there so Clean that. With my little butterfly, I'm going to put one above each butterfly. Uh, put that 
to the side for now. Bring in the inside bit. I don't know why I cleaned the stamp. Put a little one in that corner. And a big one in this corner. And then we want the sentiment I say it's your birthday and we're going to stamp that in the middle and just pray it straight yes and that is all your stamping done this anymore. Right, what I did was I got my pen end of my black stamping right marker and I just did dashes down to the hello in a circle it's a big circle and come out that was all I'd done there oh. put it on the end I forgot we need to stamp the antennas so the ones for the big butterfly. Stamp that in. And then the little butterfly. Butterflies have got their antennas on. Make them whole. So little these stamps. That's it, definitely. Now to colour them in. The little ones, I just did the inner bit in lovely lipstick. So that's all I did here, just the inner pattern. We've got beautiful weather here. It's Easter Monday and the sun is shining, it's gorgeous. one on the inside as well. Such a quick easy card. And 
and then with the mint macaron I just coloured in the inner ones of these this one as well. Right, on the middle bit here, I just came down to there and coloured that in. Just coloured in half of it. I'll do the same on this side. Going slow so I don't go out the lines. Just half of it. The retiring list has come out for stamping up. And this stamp isn't one of them. It's being carried over to next year. Thank God. But I will be doing some card using the retired or retiring stamps throughout the month of May. of April, beginning of May. There we are. That is the card. All we've got to do now is stick them to the base. Some of you might be saying, why do I bother putting white in? Well, if you're going to decorate it, if you stamp and colour it in with the um, blend pens it will come through the card and you'll have it on this side which you don't really want and it also balances out the front I'm putting a card on the front I mean I could have stamped that on the front of the card without using this but then you would have got all the bleed on the inside I suppose if you use your marker pens, you wouldn't get the bleed. Well, I wouldn't think you would. And then you could just do it on your card base. Right, all that leaves us to do is put some gems on it. Oh, I don't want the gold ones. So all I did was put three of these glass gems. I put one by each big butterfly. Right. 
and you have it one beautiful I think it is butterfly card hope you like it if you do give us a thumbs up if you'd like to see more of my cards please subscribe and if you press the bell button next to it you will be notified of any more videos I upload which is usually a Monday, Wednesday and Friday. All I can say is thank you for visiting and I hope to see you again soon.